everyone, this is Sam Fan, and welcome to the Raptors Uprising Gaming Channel. Today, I'm going to show you how you can use your freelance and quick play options to make your big man on a team the play initiator of your offense. So once you learn these triggers, you can actually turn your power forward or center, whoever has a better screening and playmaking, into the setup man for the offense, which allows your guard to just kind of attack off ball initially and then come back on ball, which is going to conserve stamina and also further break the defense by forcing switches as you can see here. So this video today is part 2 of my warrior series, so if you want to watch part 1, you can go to, to my playlist and find the video with that thumbnail right there. But uh, we are still using Warriors Freelance as the base, but this time instead of using motion, we're going to use pass and screen away as our quick play trigger. So you can see here, I'm getting the ball to uh, my power forward or center. Ideally, you want to get the ball to the best screener. So get it to the big who is the better screener. Have him bring up the ball and he can bring it up to the wing or the middle. But in this case, bring it up to the wing and call pass and screen away. Once you do that, you want to pass to the player to, uh, on the top of the key. Every single time you do this, out of Warriors Freelance, if you do it this way with the big, the big is going to go set that uh, down screen, the pin down, for the guard or the shooter in the corner. And then from this point on, you can either hit the shooter, go into the paint or icon pass, but lead him out to the three point line. If he's open, he can shoot that free. If not, he can flow into a pick and roll. But you can see time and time again, I'm having my big bring up the ball. So that's why this is so good, right? I can go to the wing with the big. And then swing it up top. He's going to go down screen the shooter in the corner. And then instead of leading him out, I can also dribble towards the corner guard. Do this kind of makeshift user on ball and off ball double screen. And then get the ball up top. And then he can also find a shot that way. Here you can see uh, I have the big round bank of the ball. But this time I'm triggering the pass and screen away from the middle. And this still works. So get the ball to the driver or another guard but make sure you don't pass it to the shooter because your big man is going to pass and then go screen the better shooter so i like to shoot with Donovan Mitchell more so i gave it to Marbury and have uh, Ibaka go set that screen for my favorite shooter here Josh Smith has the ball who is also another big i'm having him screen for Mary after he triggered the passing screen away in the middle and that's also deadly so as you can see this is very good because a lot of the time in 2k we have the guard initiate the offense and they end up doing too much but here if you get the ball to the big man or your big man just rebounds and he can go all the way up court if there's no shot you can flow into a screen and roll i suggest always switch the screen so tap l3 as you're heading towards the screen looks like a pick and roll switches on the last second this is absolutely deadly versus other users online and you can see here the perfect sequence right i'm getting a stop my big man can test the shot. Josh Murphy also can, but now he can also bring it up. I don't have to kick it to the guard if I don't want to. I can have the guard conserve energy this way. Bring it up, pass and screen away. Initiate the offense that way. Get Murray the ball. Uh, the shooter is not open here. No big deal. We're going to flow into a spread pick and roll because it's Warriors Freelance. We're going to switch that screen. And that is just very smooth, excellent play. The ball is being shared, so not, not one player is being used too much. So this conserves stamina, and it also really shifts the opposing defense. And he, obviously, you can also run the pick and roll regularly. You don't have to switch it. So you can see I'm bringing up with my big man again. Doing the pass and screen away, keeping the ball safe. Get it to Siakam. So Murray gets that screen. If he's not open, I'm just going to flow right into this pick and roll. And sometimes I don't have to switch the screen. I can just run it regularly, force a couple of switches there. Going from an off-ball screen to a flow pick and roll like that is deadly. So this will be part two of the Warriors Freelance. So make sure you go to the thumbnail or video with this thumbnail to see part one. That one we talk about motion, but this one we talk about passing screen away. Both works excellently. So enjoy this. If you got any questions, leave them in the comment section. As always, thanks for coming by, and we look forward to speak to you guys again very soon.